So we get a lot of questions about how far away will my phone connect to these devices? And they're really built specifically for the purpose of each one of them. So from a knock standpoint, you don't want to have a knock that connects 300 yards away because that's 300 yards in each direction. Think about six football fields wide, you're trying to find a little knock on the end of a tiny arrow. It's like a needle in a haystack. So what it is, it's 50 yards. And that allows you to say, hey, I'm close enough now that I can really look hard. I can activate the sound chip. I can activate the light and flash and hopefully find it. And the benefit with our search party sharing functionality, each person that has a phone that you've shared that with can go, say, 50 yards apart. And now all of a sudden you're covering hundreds of yards. As soon as one person connects, everybody's phones are updated and you can converge. The location marker is actually used very differently. Right? The location marker is you want to connect far away because you want to activate it and find that spot. So it could be a tree stand location that you want to activate 150 yards across the field as you're walking in so you can flash it once or twice and go straight to that stand. And so this goes further and the benefit is because of the size we can put a bunch of battery in which is why we recommend lithium and that pushes that out. So whether it's a trail cam you're looking for, a tree stand, a blind, it could be a blood trail marker that you've left the day before or shared with a buddy and that buddy now wants to go in and find that spot. You connect, you activate it, it's very loud, very bright, uh, and can go right to that spot. So the distance is really dependent on the usage and that's why we spent so much time engineering them that way.